Uh, last fun. piece of news here I have in regards to the NBA's in regards to uh, Kobe Bryant's family. Did you see this shit? This is some shitless shit right here. I should have included <laughs> this on the shit list. Kobe Bryant's mother in law is trying to extort uh, her daughter, his wife, uh, for five million dollars, a house and a Mercedes. Like she's trying to get that out of her daughter. Claiming that she deserves ninety six dollars an hour at twelve dollars a day for eighteen years because she raised her, so like she's saying like because I raised you, like you owe me five million dollars, a house and a Mercedes. Like she's trying to like strong strong arm her into like a bunch of free shit. I'm glad you brought this up. That's some fucking bullshit, dude. You know why I'm glad you brought this up? Why Why are you glad I brought this up? Because you already know I be on this kind of shit. I'm going to tell you right now. Tell me right now. Her mama should have the five, the house, and the Mercedes. Her why? mama because, should have it. Because she didn't do anything to earn it either? Like, come on, bro. I mean... Like what are we talking Damn, about? Like, I didn't what even are we, think about what that. What are we angle? really talking about? Like what did you do to get that money? Not I mean, that. we know. I mean, I mean, you get it. But come on now. But let's not do that, right? <laughs> God bless right, Kobe. Right. So Respect. all day, but Respect. I mean, come on, bro. What, bro? Like, I would have been like, that's all you want? <laughs> oh my gosh! Like, there's so much more than that. Like, now. This is the part I do like. It's the moral of it, though, right? Like, mom, don't just... But at the same time, it's almost kind of like, really? Like, you don't, like, That's, sometimes... It seems, like, disrespectful as fuck. It's almost me. sometimes like you don't know what your parent really had to do for you to to get you to wherever you got to. Like, you just don't know. Whether you think you know or not, you really just don't know. Yeah. Like, because you didn't raise yourself, if you think you did, that your parents still were doing something to, you know... Um, bro, I, I tell you this. More so the fact that I would do that for my mama regardless, it's more so the fact that she just has so much money and cars and houses and all the stuff that he literally How did it why like my thing though is like why did all this have to become like public though? Like why couldn't they just like keep this on like like the DL, you know what I mean? That's just, what I'm saying. Like, why would you not like, do look, like, why, I, bro. I kinda, Okay, like, so let me ask cool you, bro. If I didn't have to work for the rest of my life, why and you would have you, all this money why now. would you not just give it to your mom though? Like, well, it, we it, don't bro, know what their relationship is like. They we, could, it could be toxic. Maybe well, her mom's I mean, a piece it, of shit. It could, bro. But like, think Maybe about it. Maybe she didn't right? like Kobe, and now Kobe's gone, and she's well, trying to ask for his money. Like, I don't know. There could be more to it than that's what I'm saying, bro. Like, would that we don't know? Sure. So overall, bro, just. Just throw it, like it's bro. It's not like all yeah, because it's like even if it's bro, toxic, you could just throw the bread, and like and never don't talk to talk her to again. Him yeah. again. Like not you like just, try to ask me for more, like you're it's not mi- gonna happen. Now you're just mixing it all into when you don't have to do all this. Yeah, like because honestly, you right? You could even just give her less. You'd be like, here's two bro, mil, and like shut the fuck. You know up, what's you funny? Know what I mean? She could give her more and still not be hurt. Like Kobe left like so That's much. True. That's a good point, bro. Like this is not even like. Like a pinch or like a nightmare. And this is just like, bro, take this nickel and move. bro. A nickel. That's really what this comes down to. But, I mean, it's like I said, it's, I guess it's the moral factor. And But at the same time, look, I don't know. I maybe I have a different relationship with my mom, so I can't say, I, man, look, that'd be easy. If my mom asked me for five, I'd be like, bro, here's 20. Here's three Mercedes and, you know, two houses. Right. Love you. Go, man. Not leave me the fuck alone. <laughs> yeah, like, which she can do easily, right? right? Like, all she's asking for is some specific shit, and that that doesn't even phase you. Like, you don't even have to be worried about this. You you can be stress-free. Try to be with your daughters. Your husband's gone now. Yeah. Like, why are you letting this carry on? Females like that, though. This, let's carry it. Let's drag it. Like, what are we doing, bro? Like, bro, tell me, tell me, bro. All the money she has, like five mil, five mil, just five, not fifty mil, not five hundred mil, like five million dollars with the Mercedes and a house. You know what? I, you know, you know what? I think like set it off for me in Girl. regards to the story. The way the mom tried to justify it, like if she had just asked, it would make me really happy. I I really enjoy not having to work again. And being able to just so live just, my life. I raised her for this long, then it'd so be like I, I need this back. But her going, like, trying to nickel and dime her, like, okay, well, 
like i need this much because i raised you and that's uh 96 dollars an hour 12 hours a day for 18 years like like her trying to you see what i'm saying like that like i mean changes it makes the tone it tough. of things it a, does. a little bit like it does i'm and, the, and then at that point like that's when i'm gonna get petty like oh so like like you're talking about all this, right? All right, so like let's talk about this shit then, and like let's talk about that. Like you but see like, what I'm saying? I mean, like, but, so this is the thing. That's you when can, like but, if, if okay, it were just to be bro. like, look, like it'd be really cool. So this is what I feel like. If you only had like three million, and then somebody said, and your mom said that, then say that. But like when you sitting on like maybe a billion dollars, I'm being honest, right? Without investments and private like jets and. Even if, right, five million a Mercedes in a house, bro, look, I'm focused on so much more important stuff that even if you loved me, apparently you don't, right? Take this and just leave if, me alone. If one of your sons ends up being, like, extremely successful, would you do the same thing? Uh, like, try to mooch off of them? Mm-hmm. No, I would let them give me what they want to. I, I wouldn't even, I would never do that. Why? But if I did, though. Why? Uh, just cause I, just my morals of myself. Like I raised them to make that kind of money because it maybe should have been me. I just wasn't in a position or place to do it. They doing it. So all I can do is sit there and cherish it. And I'm glad. <laughs> so I'm do a you part th- of it. So do you, do you think your situation is any different from hers? In the sense that. Of, of asking. And in this case, so demanding. I, so look, I, I, so I wouldn't demand nothing from my kid. Right. I feel like they, like Christian would just give me that. Or Makai would just give me that. If they made money like that, I wouldn't have to be that parent that begs for it or asks for it. Right. But I'll tell you this, right? But if you find yourself having to beg for it, do you think that says something? It, it could. Right. But, like, like, so this is what I'll say. I've lived both sides of the spectrum, right? The good part is when I was younger, I started off on the shitty side where I was the person asking for a lot of money right. and asking for help. Nobody was really helping me. Now I'm on the other side. I have money all the time. I help people all the time. And I'm not just talking about, like, Family members, and I'm talking about like strangers on the side of the street. If I see one, I will chunk them five dollars every time, bro. Like I do stuff like that, and so that's nice. It's you. just like you—you you never really know how it's really like living that side of it. It's always easy to be on the other side and kind of be like, "Boy, you crazy?" Because you got them shoes on. Shut up. But she's also but, not. Uh, that's but, not really what this is either, though. Like she's asking for five million dollars. But like. <laughs> she, but but she almost has a billion dollars. So five million is almost like a person on the street asking for like just give me can I, I, guess. I can I have a dollar? I guess. Five million is a dollar yeah to that account. Like to us like you're like bro. But to Did you know you know I was actually just thinking uh, about bro. this the other day like about like 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 well off people like what their bank accounts look like. Like I've never seen I've never seen more than five figures in my bank account like ever. And, like, the idea that, like, people can just, like, like you know, I have, like, my USAA app on my I've phone. I've seen six like, one time. You could just open up your phone yeah. and you just see, like, yeah. nine figures, like, yeah. ten figures there. Just like, oh, that's what yeah. I have. And I've only seen six one time. Just turn your right. phone off. But and they have, like, like, 13 or 14 and just, like, wait, what? No, bro. What do you mean? What do you mean what? Fuck, bro. The most I have the was The idea six, of that, that is just, hard. like, I literally can't. Bro. I can't fathom that. I'm like, like that much. So, okay, let me ask you a question, bro. If you almost had like a billion dollars, even if somebody did come back and nag you, family though, like they're like your mother or your father, right? Or a sister or a brother. Whether you was really, if they asked for five and you almost had like a billion, you wouldn't be like, look, I'm going to give you this and this is what it is. Like you said, put it in a contract or just don't. Just be like, this is the five. Just leave me the fuck alone. You tell me you wouldn't drop five million a Mercedes in a house. The, this and you is, have like a billion. I see what you're saying. There's only one other side of that angle that I'd be like a little concerned about. That I mean, I would handle just fine, but could be a factor. If they just try to come back and do it again, like well, at a later no. time. You give one person money, then the rest, like everyone's. Oh going no, home. no! A lot of people get just the answer no. Right. But your mom though. Right. Well, your, that's like different. your mom is not a cousin or like. Well, a, also I'm gonna be honest. My relationship know? with that person means a lot too, though. Like my that's mom, like saying. I would just do it because I love my mom. But like if me and my mom had like an unhealthy relationship and she was a piece of shit to me, I probably wouldn't give her shit if I'm being honest. I I still would, bro. I don't or I'd know. make her earn it, bro. I maybe I would. I'd be too, like, prove to me that you're worth it. I just feel like parents are a big deal. I feel like parents, parents are a big deal. No matter what they do, they try their best, 
And unless you, well, we also you both know, have different perspectives because you are a dad. You right, know what I mean. So right. it is a little different. <laughs> I tried my best. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> right. I don't but know. I mean, it, I agree with you though. I'd be like, ah, you know what? I like, have a lot. You get one. You ask for five. So that's why I right. see, and that's why I said I would just overdo it. I'd be like, you ask for five million. You ask for a Mercedes in the house. You can have the house. You can have a Mercedes. I'll throw you a Range Rover. And I'm gonna give you seven million. Don't talk to me, bro. I gave you more than what you even asked for. Right. Take that and, and just right. leave me alone. That was already that was already your one and your plus one. Like I don't Dog. need to hear shit from you. Dog, we're good. Right. You got an extra car. You still got the right. house. And I gave you more money. Right. Go chill. Just don't talk to me, bro. There's no, for the rest of your lifetime. That should be enough. Right. I don't want to hear about money ever again. Dog. <laughs> you know? Yeah. But it's like, that's my mom. She birthed me. I'm at least in this position. Right. Because of her. So I guess, like. I guess. <laughs> right. It's tough, but. Yeah. All right. Leave me alone. Yeah. Love you too. Yeah. 